Hi friends, welcome to my channel. This is video tutorial about Creo 2D Sketcher. The Sketcher is 2D version of the features or model being created. The sketch is required to convert 2D sketch to 3D model using the sketched features. Here, you are going to learn how to creating a sketch using Creo Line Chain Tool and Normal Dimension Tool by drawing an example as shown here. Also you will learn to use Line Tangent Tool, Center Line, and Center Line Tangent Tools. First let us see how to draw this sketch using Line Chain Tool and Normal Dimension Tool. For drawing the sketch, you have to open a sketch interface. For that go to the new and select the sketch and memorize this icon and give the name as the line sketch as okay click okay okay there is no space click okay okay this is the sketch interface if you click on the grid button it will show the grids you can You can enter the spacing of the grids or you can use the dynamic and click OK. Here you can view the grid, display grid. Okay. This is the grid. If, it is, if there is no grid, it's not a problem. You can directly use the line command here. Okay. I'm going to create this uh, sketch on the, the sketch interface using the line command and the normal dimension tool for that go to the ribbon area the sketching area this is the line command the line chain command click on it okay select anywhere and drag click on it and drag the line it shows uh, uh, it shows as the horizontal line if it is an inclined line it will not show anything and if it is vertical line it will show the V as the vertical line so I'm going to create this horizontal line and press the mouse middle button to stop the line chain action okay I'm going to apply the dimension here here it is 48 this is the weak link dimension Here I'm going to enter as 48 and press enter. See, it's, it becomes 48 mm. Okay. Again, select the line and click on this endpoint and uh, drag upwards. Okay. Again, again, press the mouse middle button. And here you just uh, roughly enter the dimension as uh, 30 mm. Okay, it's 30. Again, click the line chain action and draw the line horizontal line and the vertical line and again the horizontal line and uh, enter the dimension as the 22 mm and the this dimension as the 21 mm okay the height I'm roughly giving uh, 7 And the same again select the line command and draw the line. You can also snap the height from here. Ok. 
okay and for the same shape like this for some of these have the other points okay and uh, the normal dimension as this point and this point as the 37 for selecting this dimension click on this and sorry, on this and enter the press the middle button mouse button but it will create the 37 mm and the other dimensions are keep it like this and okay you can see the same sketch this way you can create the sketch too and you can also if you want to assign dimension between two entities go to the normal dimensions and select the entities two entities I selected already and click the middle boss button so it will place the dimension between these two entities also for uh, next uh, let's learn the line tangent to you can access it from the ribbon area of the sketching this is the line tangent yeah, I made two circles of different of different sizes and I want to make the tangent circle tangent line uh, in between these two circles for that I'm going to select the line tangent here two and they select the first circle and the select the second circle so I made the two tangent means one tangent line again also you can again you can select the tangent line like this this way you can create the tangent to means tangent line in preo next you will see how to create the center line in creo sketcher for that go to the remote area in the data section you can see the center line command click on it and click anywhere on the sketch interface you can make the horizontal inclined or vertical uh, center lines okay you can click again on any point to make it uh, center line and also I'm going to make horizontal line and uh, uh, again you can also make horizontal line uh, this way you can create the center lines in the 2d sketcher of the Creo interface and uh, I think you got a better understanding about uh, how to use the line chain tool line tension tool and the normal dimension tool and also the center line tool thank you friends